hi guys you're welcome back we are still on the material design model forms this time we'll be looking at the login form first tag can you see we have the diff the class model with fit and we have an idea of login form model which is actually from the style css the login form model with a padding of 0 and 20 pixels top and bottom back to the index we have a tab index of minus one a role of dialogue we need a dialogue so it's going to pop out as a dialogue and the area labeled of login form now we have another diff tag right inside the parent div with a model dialogue what's the role of this document this model dialogue is gotten from The style CSS. Let's get to find it here. And so the model dialog, which is for the sign up form model with a model dialog class. Now it has a maximum width of 360 pixels with a margin of 30 pixels auto to the four sides. Back to index.html. We have another tag, which is for the class model content. Now for the content itself, let's get to see. The first goes with a button, you know, that's for the dismiss button. That's like a cancel, which actually having a span of true, you know, aerial hidden true. That's the times, it's like a times. The closing button now we have the class for the login form let's get to look at the css first back here let me pick it up so let's see what the css talks before we look at the java at the javascript class the login form now you find it right there in the media query for the font size for the padding we actually give it 11 pixels and zero pixels can you see here the login from we have we assign the weight auto the background color transparent the display of black width auto now these are all styles the width of 100 percent outline zero this is for the label margin bottom zero font weight 100 color assign a sort of gray this is for the input error background color assign red left zero width 100 percent visibility visible this is for the text field, which is for the material design text field, width 100. For the card actions, margin top 5 pixels. And for the A tag, assign a font size of 12 pixels. Back to the index.html. Now we have the MDL card. So it's actually going to come in a card layout, which is from the material design layout that's the material design minified css we have the shadow on this we have for the image which is the logo can you see the logo that's for the image source so it's, it's, it's actually going to have the first as a logo we have the day class for the logo model logo now let's get to look at the form itself. This is the MDL card from the material design supporting text. We have a form action of not actually forwarding to anything. So if you want to extend this either using ASP.NET or using PHP, you need to give a form action here. And the method is post. Now we have an idea of login form. The login form CSS. Let's get to look at what this is doing. 
the login from can you see it here we all we both checked it we've all seen what it was doing the margin the weight and the rest now we have the first field which is the username whereby we have the mdl text field which is from the material design we have an input tag for the name login username id login username and we have the label that carries the input which is username we have for the password now we have buttons for login so this is actually going to be triggered so you can actually attach once you give an action a click on this is going to actually implement the action we now have another small card with the end the card border get to look at this in the let's quickly look at it the bow is actually sitting in the css which is the material magnified css let's get to find it here You see it MDL card border. The border bottom of one pixel is solid. Let me get it back. Border. With a border color, this is this to it. Border bottom, one pixel, solid. RGBA, which is the color dimensions of the border same thing goes for it over here so that's just how you can actually search for content or for usage in the material magnified css back to our index.html now we are for the forgot password and for create account so a closing div tag for all open div tag and see as you click on it, it tells you which one is actually brazen up so the end of the login from let's get to look at the url of this particular form let's refresh a click what do you notice like a drop down came from the top of the browser and displays a card this is a card in material design google material design this is called a card with firstly the logo and input text with a, the int of username an order for password a login from a login button rather you know which is triggered can you see there is sort of validation you need to passing something into this so we get to look at the java code we have the forgot password and the create a, an account let's quickly look at what the js says the main.js now this is the validation or form validation this is actually jquery document ready function to create a variable called login from we attach the id login from i think we saw the id right there so this is an if statement if the login from len what will happen the login from validates and the rules follows login username required login password required error placement function so is actually going to catch the error you can actually give a text for the error instead of just catching it alone you give it a graceful text so you have to return true for this login form so that's just uh, the little validation with the material card for our login form can you see the cancel button over here so you can easily cancel this I click on the login form again you know you input the text the password click on your login you can easily do what cancel out thank you very much for hanging out with me throughout this 
uh, session. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And we'll be talking about the sign up in the next model. Don't go anywhere. Bye bye for now.